Hotel headquarters in El Segundo, California. This is where management runs the biggest toy corporation in the world. The corporation's mission is to positively impact their people, products, and planet through responsible play. We uh, just got kicked out of the toy store downstairs while trying to uh, film our project, so we decided to hide out up at the uh, parking structure over here. Um, we are about to go inside and ask if a Ken is here, because we're trying to interview Ken and ask him about his financial statements. Uh, on camera. Hi, we were wondering uh, where Ken was. Uh, yeah. Do you have any idea where he is? Or... Do you guys need to talk to security? No. Oh, okay. that's fine. Okay, we cannot find Ken anywhere. You're at this hotel. No. Hello, Mr. Stockton? Yes, have you seen our good friend Ken anywhere? He seems really upset and we can't find him. Oh, really? Well, you're in luck. I'm actually with Ken right now. He turned up at our board meeting to voice his concerns about his friends at Mattel. We've had to set aside over $24.7 million for the lawsuits that have been filed against us for the lead paint problems, and we believe this will be enough to cover the expenses. Mattel values its family more than anything else. Toy safety has always been our highest priority. Over the years, we have earned a reputation as an industry leader. Sadly, this has made the recalls in 2007 all the more disappointing for us. We are proud of the way in which we responded by taking immediate and unprecedented action to right the wrongs that happened to Ken's friends. Mattel has received several honors for its global citizenship efforts. We are listed within the top 10 best corporate citizens. But given our recent problems, Mattel has had to create a three-point plan to tighten their control of production, discover and prevent the unauthorized use of subcontractors, and test the products itself rather than depending on contractors. We understand why Ken is upset, as we ourselves are disappointed in what has happened and how our internal controls have failed. The Mattel family plans to make this incident an exception to our otherwise excellent behavior as corporate citizens.